Technology Officer of Rovio Studios. We are currently in the works of a game called Angry Birds. We took a bit of inspiration from another game called Crush the Castle. That game has a lot of interesting mechanics and physics when it comes to destroying buildings and defeating enemies. We didn't want to copy the game too much, so we added a plot to our version, where the bird's eggs are stolen by green piggies. That's basically why it's called Angry Birds. We are halfway done with it, although we do need to add some sounds and music. We already have the bird sounds that we extracted audio from another program. But I was thinking either two things for the pig sounds. One, record a human making pig sounds. Or option two, have a real pig create all the sounds for the pigs. Option two sounds like a good idea. We are thrilled and we are excited for the final result and outcome of the game and surely make it as entertaining as possible for people to enjoy. 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 To manager of Rovio Studios. We went with option two, use real pigs as the voice of our pigs. Some employees are not really fond of this idea, but we'll take full responsibility to treat the animals with love and care. We are starting the process tomorrow at 1pm. I am truly excited to be working on this project, and the company is too. Let's see how this works out. Goodbye. Audio recording number three. The employees brought the pigs somewhere around 11 a.m., but we couldn't. <laughs> we couldn't find them anywhere. Either those animals somehow escaped, or they were kidnapped. I, I don't know how this happened, but the entire company is freaking out now, and oh, I'm the one to blame for this idea. Police are on their way to help us track the pigs. I truly hope they're found. Audio log, oh, whatever. This project was unsuccessful, failed. The company couldn't find the animals, nor the police. They're lost and gone. The company has been silent for almost a week now because